morning everyone happy sunday i thought i'd just show you uh my bathroom um i'm about to clean it and i'm gonna hoover it first so i'll speed that bit up if i can on the video but before i start i just wanted to show you my little um uh, hinge hall box of tricks so i've got a little bathroom box because i've got an upstairs bathroom and a downstairs toilet and i've got a shower in my bedroom as well so instead of having two of everything i just take this little basket with me um i've got some uh, liquid soda crystals in there which are just the same as normal soda crystals but you just don't have to um, dilute them in water um, I've got a little squeegee for the shower next door um, I've got my Zaflora mix oh I've even labelled it um, I've got some rubber gloves um, I've got some Aldi surface wipes um, these are really important for the toilet got my rubber gloves sausage Get out of the way. rubber gloves um, this product's amazing, it's um, to spray on all your uh, steel while you're like taps, shower head, blah 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 in the bathroom, um, that's really good. And I've also just left this in here to show you, I bought this just from co-op when I was in there because I was like, oh you know, need something for the toilet, and yeah it's fine, it's good, it works, there's nothing wrong with it, but on Mrs Hinch's advice, I bought this the Mountain Pine Harpic Toilet Cleaner. And oh my God, what a difference. Um, it's not that much more expensive, but it makes such a difference to toilet cleaning. And I'll show you that in a bit. Okay, bye. Sorry, also I forgot to say, um, I've got this big roll of um, blue kind of kitchen towel. I normally use kitchen roll, but because it's like quite a big shortage of that at the moment, I went into the shed and got this from the kennels. We use this to clean the bowls once the dogs have eaten, and it's quite thin. It's just like that blue, thin kitchen, well, it's like industrial kitchen paper, but it's really useful. So I've brought a roll of that up as well instead of kitchen roll. You want to let me know, now that you've let me go, life is better still. And I guess somehow You'll just keep on coming back I wanna let you know Now that you've let me go Life is better still And I guess somehow Everyone says you're coming back bathroom I hoover all over the toilet all over the cistern down around the base um, I hoover the bath I hoover the sink I hoover the windowsill there's just fine fluff everywhere and uh, it comes off clothes and towels and having animals and all these different things um, the reason I use these is because it doesn't really matter what order you clean your bathroom in um, these are just going to go in the bin straight away, so you're never going to cross-contaminate wiping around the sink with a cloth that you've already used on the toilet, which obviously is pretty minging. Um, so before I actually do that, I've jumped the gun a little bit. Um, I'm going to clean inside the toilet so that it has time to um, mellow whilst I clean the rest of it. So I'm going to go straight to this Mrs Hinch product the pine she puts that in a toilet every single day um, and I was like oh my god what a waste of money when I first saw it and then um, actually this bloody good you get it right and you push it right up into the rim which I've never done before and but I copied her and she puts quite a lot in now I don't know if you've just seen that there's a little bit of like black stuff just come off straight away from up inside here and you can see this is disgusting up here. So all I do, she puts that in every day and she just leaves it like that. But um, if you get your toilet brush, you get it a little bit wet, you get some of the product on it, and you can actually just 
have a proper little scrub up and into oh my god look at that you can tell it this is a new product that i haven't used very much before and the stuff i was using before was this the co-op stuff so you can see that i'm not joking it's not even staged And you don't need anything else. You don't need like these major hacks of white wine vinegar or anything like that to get things off. Just a good old bit of elbow grease and a toilet brush. Look at that. That's not poo. That's just like a bit of toilet grime. I'm going to flush it. Let me know just what you're thinking, oh.